to build a nation. The conception of a technically advanced nation which could sustain the aspirations of its people was a stiff challenge after independence. The dream of building a modern India which was geared for the challenges of the 21st century was real. But all that could happen only if India was technically and scientifically superior. The IITs were created at strategic locations throughout India, one of them being at Delhi, established in 1961. Realizing its need to be a catalyst in the development of the nation and its various technical sectors, Civil Engineering Department was created as one of the first major departments at IIT Delhi. Since then, it has made its presence felt in each of its endeavors. The Department of Civil Engineering has played a very important role in these 50 years in practically all aspects of life on this campus. From 1961, the department has moved from a small shed to occupying 4,500 square meters of area on the campus. The early work in the department was all about setting up of state-of-the-art facilities. It all started under head of department, Professor R.J. Cornish. Civil engineering has always touched upon wider aspects of the society, catering to its essential needs, ranging from homes for shelter, transportation infrastructure, irrigation for food production, water supply, sanitary systems, power generation, communications, etc. Therefore, it provides abundant opportunities to serve the society and the nation. The Department of Civil Engineering at IIT Delhi, since its inception, has been imparting high quality education and training at both undergraduate and postgraduate levels besides delivering prolific research outcomes in cutting edge areas. The department faculty has been actively advising industry and government agencies on live infrastructural issues of development. Today, the department boasts of advanced academic and research facilities under the five main sections of Structural Engineering, Geotechnical Engineering, Water Resources Engineering, Environmental Engineering, Transportation Engineering. The Structures Group is actively involved in teaching, research and consultation activities related to structural analysis, design, construction and health monitoring of built environment. Their work includes all kinds of structures such as residential buildings, skyscrapers, bridges and flyovers. We foresee that the research in the Structural Engineering Group will grow in the areas of sustainable and engineered materials and buildings, advanced construction technologies and project management, structural protection technologies and sensors for damage detection. In the future, it will be possible to virtually simulate every aspect of structures under construction and in service, ensuring safety, economy and sustainability of our infrastructure.
The geotechnical laboratories spread over an area of 9,000 square foot. The equipment and support systems are best in the country and the faculty have designed and fabricated several equipments. The group does excellent research in the new frontiers of geotechnical engineering. The work carried out by the, the group has been recognized nationally and internationally. In the future, the group plans to strengthen research and teaching in areas such as geo-environmental and geo-hazards, physical, mechanical, thermal behavior of rocks, dynamic effects on foundations, energy geotechnology, reliability-based design, nuclear waste repositories, and urban infrastructure environment. Water Resources Group at IIT Delhi is actively involved in teaching, research and consultation activity related to both aspects of water, that is quality and quantity analysis. The entire curriculum is highly interdisciplinary in nature and involves knowledge of all aspects of science, math and computing. The faculty is currently involved in research areas such as application of geoinformatics to water resources engineering. The thrust areas in water resources include geoinformatics for sustainable management, hydrodynamic and water quality modeling, multi-objective analysis, hydraulics of distribution systems, phytoremediation and bioremediation of soils, flow through natural barriers. Environmental engineering and management has been carving out sustainable solutions in the area of water, air and environmental systems since its inception has contributed immensely in providing meaningful solutions for society through industrial and governmental projects. The Faculty of Environmental Engineering and Management has been involved in providing practical and affordable solutions. The Faculty of Environmental Engineering is targeting focused research in the field of reuse of wastewater or using innovative designs and other innovations. The environmental group will focus on making our students innovative to provide sustainable solutions to problems. Developing sustainable indexes of fast-growing cities of India and developing laboratory and simulation capacities for the future. Transportation engineering has been an integral part of undergraduate curriculum in IIT Delhi. Uh, it is a required course for all undergraduate students which is covering pavement engineering, uh, design of highways, transportation planning and traffic engineering. We also have state-of-the-art laboratory which is focusing on pavement materials and highway uh, engineering. Uh, at MTech levels, looking at the demand in the country, since 2005, a master's program has been introduced. The research focus of the group has always been very interdisciplinary. New areas of research include application of IT in transport and modeling freight traffic. This is planned by increasing collaboration with faculty members from computer science, mechanical department and environment group in the civil engineering. Apart from its bachelor's program, the department also offers programs in geotechnical and geo-environmental engineering, rock engineering and underground structures, structural engineering, construction engineering and management, environmental engineering and management, water resources engineering, transportation engineering. The department also hosts two postgraduate programs sponsored by LMT and Delhi Metro and a long distance program with Addis Ababa in Ethiopia. The department also has 100 PhD students. The department also has research and development collaboration with institutions and companies around the world including Europe, North America, East Asia and Australia. 
the hundreds of students who graduate every year from the department with graduate and postgraduate degrees have actively contributed to both the public and private sectors nationally and internationally. The civil engineering department has helped change various aspects of the infrastructure of the nation through its technological brilliance and expertise. Examples of its contribution can be seen all around India. The country is going through massive nation building projects of the infrastructure. The civil engineering department has to play an important role and we have to orient ourselves so that we are recognized more as a research institution in the world and for that we should start doing cutting edge research. We should start getting more funding and we should brand ourselves as a research institution in the next 50 years. The civil engineering department is determined to take on the new challenges that the 21st century has thrown upon us.